Hello everyone, I'm meteorologist Cassie Nall and for our Thursday, much of the same in the forecast as what we've seen all week long. Warm and humid weather with scattered showers and thunderstorms developing for the back half of our day. Now because we don't have a lot in the way of steering winds, those storms are going to kind of meander around at their own pace, develop along outflow boundaries from other storms. They're going to be popping up kind of sporadically today, so just keep an eye and an ear to the sky. Because they are moving so slowly, they also could produce a lot of heavy rain in a short period of time. We could see gusty winds, frequent lightning, and even some small hail as well. So again, just be safe with those storms that we'll have there for the back half of our day. And high temperatures will be into the middle and upper 80s to around the 90 degree mark. Now this evening, the showers and storms will gradually migrate back towards the north and the west, back towards the beaches, eventually tapering off as we go into the overnight hours. Lows will be down into the upper 60s and the lower 70s. And this pattern, it's going to continue all the way into tomorrow and then into our weekend. We're going to continue to have that moisture in place. And with that light easterly wind flow starting off each morning, as the sea breeze pushes inland and it collides with that, showers and storms will develop. So as we go into our weekend and you're starting to make your plans, just do have a heads up that if you're having an outdoor plan, maybe during the afternoon you might want to have an indoor backup option. So in case those showers and storms do pop up, you can stay safe with the weather we'll be seeing around the Sun Coast on Saturday and Sunday. Tune in to SNN, your Suncoast News Network on Verizon Fios Channel 26 or Comcast Channels 6 in Sarasota County or 11 in Charlotte County.